and they, uh, a lot of the rooms were empty, you know. Mm -hmm. I don't know. I want to tell you, at Tana's party, there was a physician's assistant. He's, he's a friend of Tana's. And he works in the gastro gastroenterology cancer department at the hospital next door. Mm -hmm. And he said that the veterans hospital and their department share doctors. Oh, that right? Yeah, and he said they're, it's a real good department. The doctors are all real good. So, um, he, you might come in contact with him. I don't know. His name is Tim. He's a male name. Tim. Tim. I'll yeah. keep my mouth. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know what they're going to do with me. I don't know. I'll go down to ICU or trip over or whatever. Did you find out what time your surgery is? No, they figured that uh, they'd start me at around 10 o'clock. Oh. And that. Uh, Yes, okay. uh, but I got a prep and everything. I get that prep tonight, and then I'll get up and work. And I, I, I'll just be getting ready to go ahead and shave and brush my teeth. Mm -hmm. And they said that... Um, but we're not going to stay very long. No, that's all right. I, hey, I like the company. <laughs> Everybody says, is your family coming? I said, well, part of it. I said, told the rest. <laughs> well, Tana's going to come in the morning. Is she? Yeah, and because we think someone from your family should be here while you're having the surgery. You know, it don't make any difference to me. I'm going to be out. So I know, I, but what if the doctors wanted to talk to somebody? Well, that's true, too. And I'm the one that told them to stay home. You know, they were, and then they're going to back up, too. I know Ellie can't make the trip, no, you know. No, And uh, so I just told them, no, just stay home. You know. It'll be fine. And we'll call as soon as we know anything. Anyway, so Tana's coming up here. Oh, no. Ray, he's been here. He's going to show me food. No, he's videoing us talking. Oh, <laughs> anyway, so Tana's going to come up here, I don't know what time, and then her, uh, Chris's girlfriend's going to drop her off here, oh. I think around 10.30. And then um, after I have my appointment, I have a counseling appointment with my granddaughter. Oh, that's right. And after that, then I'll come up here. And pick Tana up. And, oh, I see. And maybe by then you'll be. They figured, I think, two and a half to three hours. I won't be here till probably one. Well, yeah, so you can be about right. Yeah, that's be about right. Be about right, I guess. But Tana's going to come up at 1030. Oh, okay. So you won't see her, but she, I told her that you were going to be on the ninth floor after you have your surgery. Yeah, this is the eighth, I guess. Eighth floor. Tana knows what to do. She knows how to get around hospitals. Oh, I imagine. What are you doing, Frank? <laughs> Just enjoying himself. <laughs> he, he, he likes to video things about it. But I want to ask you a question. Mm -hmm. What branch of the military were you in? Army. Army. I was in Korea. I went in 1950 and got out in uh, 53. So that was after World War II. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I had to register. I was in school, and I had uh, my last year of school, and uh, they wouldn't take me out because you know, I wanted to finish school. So I had to register, but uh, if it would have went on any longer, I'd be able to got it. Was Uncle Wally in World War II? Yeah, Wally, Chuck, and Jim. For some reason, I thought Wally was in the Navy. Yeah, he oh, was. he was. Yeah. Yeah. Him and Chuck both were in the Navy, oh. and Bob was. I was the only one 